Hello there and welcome to Fairyland Cottage and thanks very much for joining me here today. We're getting some lovely warm weather here in Ireland so I thought it was a nice opportunity to show you how I make my rose water toner. Let's get into the video. First thing you will need are some smelling roses. So if you haven't got one then you can ask your florist just make sure they are the ones that smell. You want them scented. I used about three rose heads for this and pluck off all the petals. And you'll find that there's little bugs on them. I like to blow them away. I don't want to cook them. And then I'll also steep them in a bowl of water just to get rid of any more dirt. Strain it through. This is the lovely John's wort. This grows wild in Ireland and it's just about ready to flower. Next, you'll need a pot and you're going to simmer the rose petals in some water. I use about one part rose petals to three parts water, so I used half a cup of rose petals here. And what you want to do is you want to make sure that it's just simmering. You don't want to boil it. And you can use distilled water if you have it. in about 30 minutes. And you'll see the petals kind of slightly change color and the water will turn a different shade and then you just take it off after the 30 minutes and let it cool. And strain it into one of your favorite bottles. I like to use a muslin cloth so no little bits get in there. And I'm just reusing a bottle that was an essential oil bottle. And you can see that lovely rose kind of color, even with the white petals. And then I need to get myself a little strainer. <laughs> That's swallowed off. And it goes to the bottle I'm going to use. And then this is an old spray from before. I always keep everything because I know I'll reuse it. And it's really refreshing on your face, especially if you're away on holidays, or, you know, it's really warm. You can put it on your pillow as well and bring it with you when you're out and about for the day just for a bit of a refresh. Now it's got a very short shelf life because it is made with water and there's no preservative so I keep it in the fridge for about a week. That's it. Chat to me on Instagram or down below as always. I'm really grateful for you watching the video. I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful week. Bye.